you're anything like me, there's a few simple things that bring you joy in life. Simpsons reruns, preseason 19. Chips in all their wonderful, glorious flavors. Monsters in just about any shape or form. Fictitious, real, imaginary. Some of those overlap. Uh, and project kits, as obviously I've been doing on this channel. So I'm very happy today to be able to share something that combines two of those. It's the U Gears Dragon Kit. Now the official name is the Model Windstorm Dragon. And then it's got a bunch of what looks to be Cyrillic letters or Ukrainian in there. But what it is, it's a wooden kit. A wooden kit doesn't require any glue, doesn't require any pinning like working with balsa, but makes a mechanical dragon that actually will move when you press this lever and use rubber bands and it even has paper wings that look pretty rad. So, in this next little bit, I'm going to be unboxing and then building this, and you can follow along with me and take a look at it. Hopefully, if I enjoy doing this, this is the start of a new series of these wooden kits that although they are not electrically powered, are really kind of neat and fun to play around with. So now we'll just get into it. Okay, so first things first, what do we get when you order something like this? Well, you get the box, the pretty rad cover art. You can see I've already unwrapped the wood pieces, but you got the wood here that's laser cut out. Back with some close up of the information. You can see the wings move up and down, and you get a couple pictures, some language, some ads for the other kits. And it looks like there are 320 parts to this. So no telling how long it's going to take to build. Alright, so we've got the wood pieces. See, it's plywood. They are laser cut. They pop out. They're, they're in there pretty stiff, but I have a feeling they'll pop out easily. More bits. More bits. More bits. If you notice where there are holes, they've already been punched, which is good because that means I won't have a million little chips and punches floating around the apartment uh, on the floor until I eventually get off my lazy butt and sweep. Instruction manual. Not a lot of words, but does have measurements and then very good pictures of the kit in action. We've got the paper wings, some thread, which we'll probably use, some thread we'll probably use, rubber bands, I'm sure, more rubber bands. And this is a bit of 240 grit sandpaper, which I'm assuming would be just to kind of clean up any edges, especially along the gears. And a little piece of wax, which again, will probably go with the gear mechanisms to reduce any chance of friction or binding. Well, this is pretty awesome. I'm very excited to get this started. 